So what are the main difference between Office 365, Office 2009 and Office Online? Office Online, you can get it free in any operating system without downloading or without paying anything. So I'll tell you at the end. So please watch the video till the end. So let's go to the website. Office.com or Microsoft.com is the genuine website. So please go to those websites. Don't try any other website. Let's go to the Office.com. So once you click on Office.com, you have two options, sign in and get office. Once you click on get office, you can come here. So here under home, you have office home and student 2019. So this is office 2019. In this, you will get only one time purchase for Mac or PC, right? In this, this is Indian price based on your country. It will automatically take your Indian country price. So in this, you will get only classic apps like Word, Excel and PowerPoint. So nothing else. You will not get any uh, system update or any technical support. You will not get anything, right? So once you click on no more, once you can learn more, so you will get this website. You can go through that later. So here if you go to the system requirement, in PC you have Windows 10. So you must have Windows 10 to get a Office 2019, right? So now what is Office 365? What is the difference between 2019 and 365? Office 365 is also Microsoft 365, only new features about added. So now, in Office 365 or Microsoft 365, you don't have directly one-time op payment option. You have either pay monthly or you can pay yearly, right? So once you pay that, what will, what are the benefits you will get? You will get regular system updates. So when Microsoft release any updates, you will get updates, right? In this 2019, once you got 2019, that's it. You will not get any updates. You will not get any any anything, right? Suppose 365 now uh, Microsoft release and later uh, it released 2020 or 21, then you can upgrade to that software free of, I mean, without any charge and directly you can upgrade. And you will also get Microsoft technical support. Currently, 2019 and 365, this Word, Excel, PowerPoint, three things are almost the same, only light, uh, uh, slightly extra features, nothing else. Apart from this, in Office 365, you will get Apart from your classic apps, you will get OneNote, Outlook, Access and Publisher. And you will get OneDrive also for one person and one TV. So based on your uh, requirements, so in case of family, you will get six up to six people and six terabyte. Similarly for business, in business, if you click on business, you have in business, you have only 365. There is no concept of 2019. You get only 365, right? You can go to the plans. Now, what is Office Online? How you can get Office Online free? To get Office Online free, you have to click on Sign In. You can use any email ID. You can use Gmail, Yahoo, any email ID, and you can use Sign In. So here, in this case, password will be different. Just you need to follow the procedures, and you can do that. So once you click on Sign In, you will get this this page here. So my account is already I have paid for that, so I can go for install Office. In your case you will not get this option. You will get only below options, right? In this, you can click on start new. Once you click on start new, it will pop up will show. You can create Word, Excel or PowerPoint or directly you can go to the Word and you can right click open a new tab. You can do that. I have clicked already open a new tab. Once you click on open new tab, you will get a screen like this. So what are the previous documents you have saved? It will show in the down. And if you want to create a blank document, you can click on new tab. Once you click on new tab, you will get like this. I have already written Office 365 fee. You can change the color. So all the features, whatever you are getting there, you will get the same features. Okay. So here what will happen? It will be little slow. It will not be that much fast. The speed will be a bigger, speed will be as per your internet speed. Okay. So first one thing you should remember, you should always click on switch ribbon. So if it is showing half of the ribbon, you can click on that so that you will get the full ribbon. Right. So now the next thing is how we can get for students, right? For educational purpose, how you can get the free. You have two options. One is for students and teachers and one for school. Once you click on office for the first option, we selected students and teacher, you will get these options. Here for students, you can click on your uh, school email ID and get started and you can get it free. 
so for that you can go to the procedures and you can follow the procedures in case for schools you can click on schools and you can get start for free so there are small procedures and sign up requirements are there you can go to that and you can enjoy it but for general online you don't need anything you don't need any uh, um, payment or you don't need any anything just you need to sign in or sign up and you can use it free okay thanks for watching